Hello my buddies, welcome to Capture Hood Recaps. Please like and subscribe to our channel for more interesting recaps. Let's dive into world of entertainment. Just imagine, suddenly the lifeless toys kept in your room come alive and become enemies of your life. Something like this happens in our today's story. At the beginning of the story, we see the murderer whose name is Rain Shop. One night, he reached the mansion of a man named Hans Morris with his car and the president of this core toy making company is Rain Shaw. He was looking at some toys in his storeroom when his hand went to a green fairy rancho was keeping an eye on him from outside and now he had his. Decided to execute the plan, he said loaded and put on the mask and moved towards the door. He puts a phone outside to dodge the security guard, on which the countdown was going on, hurriedly went to throw the phone out and at the same time Ranjo entered the mansion, seeing the opportunity, he shot the security guard and because the silencer was installed in the Ghana, so the sound of the bullet did not reach Moria. Then he stole the keys from the guard and easily reached the security room. He turned off all the CCTV cameras and finally sour his flesh, after which he went to Morris's room. On the way, he pinched another security guard. As soon as he reached the room, he fired two bullets on Morris's chest and one on the forehead, killing him on the spot. Rancho picked him up with a green fairy toy which he would keep as a symbol of his victim, Morris. He saw a picture of a Mauritian man on the table, the one who had something written on it did not think much about it and came out of there. He informed his client in the plane about the completion of the mission and sat comfortably after a while. A girl sitting near him asked him for chewing gum, which opens his back to get out, seeing that green fairy toy in his garden. The girl also thought that such a big man keeps toys in his garden. But he did not say anything, later after landing at the airport, he saw that the news of Mauritius's blood had spread all around. Then his eyes were on a girl's garden. After this, there was this doll like she had seen in Morris's room, after which strange things started happening to her. There was also a green toy on the reception table of the building of her house, which also used to be on the morality table. On arrival, Ranjo decorated him with Hari Perry on a display table, where he kept the signs of all the people whom he had killed, there were glasses, keys, pens, money, and what else that once belonged to those who died. Who came? She saw in the camera that the receptionist was standing at her door with a big box in her hand. When she did not open the door, she left the box there, and then Rain Show brought the box inside and kept it on the kitchen counter. The box had his name on it, but the name of the sender was not written, although it was signed on which it looks exactly and looks like its man's signature. At first, Rangshan thought that it was better to throw the box, but then he could not stop himself from opening it. He started taking off the wrapper very closely. Inside, he found a box full of toys which came from Morris's company. It was written on the back of the box that there is also a secret bonus surprise in it. At first, Rancho investigated the whole thing whether it is a trap, but it is nothing like this. When he opened the box, there were many plastic soldiers in it who had guns in their hands. He took out the toy and looked carefully but it was completely normal, later suddenly the box fell down on its own. Rancho remembered very well that the box was not on the shore, as soon as he went to check, he was shocked to see all those toys disappeared from the box. And now one strange thing after another started to happen, but the day started shaking itself and suddenly all the lights also turned off. Rancho saw that someone had cut the cable of the lights, the same sail was a soldier. His swift people had understood that all this was done by these soldiers, as soon as he bent down to see them, the soldiers started firing indiscriminately at him, although the bullets did not harm him much. But now he was afraid, who was afraid of toys. Man mummy soon they threw an explosive and his pant burnt Rahisha realized that this soldier is a small packet big explosion. Now he ran towards the bathroom to think of a way to avoid them. But there was continuous firing from behind. Blood was coming from his knee. And there were a lot of bullets on the garden too, they would not kill him, but he was in a lot of pain when Rancho checked the condition outside using a mirror. He saw that the army of soldiers was constantly attacking the light bulbs so that it would become completely dark. Then suddenly they blew his glass with a missile, Ray was filled with anger. Quickly went to his room and took out the gun, with the help of the gun. He somehow reached the saved kitchen where he had hidden his rifle. He took out the rifle and started firing continuously, Silence all around in a few hundreds. All the soldiers hid in fear. The rancho took advantage of this opportunity and overturned the entire sofa where he found the bodies of many soldiers who survived. 
He was picking up the rest and putting them in the jeep. He just kept watching with his eyes. He could not believe that this is true. As soon as the soldiers started running, he put everyone under his feet as much as possible. They were still firing at him, but when Rinsho fired a shot, half of the soldiers were thrown away from its vibration. But the attack was not over yet. In a short time, three army helicopters came flying and fireballs. Attacked by rain shot, somehow managed to escape from them. Then they showed their real strength and started smashing missile Danny on him. Rezhan ran to his bathroom and locked himself. On seeing himself in the mirror, his head was spinning. There were many cuts and scars on his face and body. He tried to bandage his ointment by applying alcohol. But then suddenly the fold ripped through the door and fell inside, as well as a helicopter came in and started again on the attack on Ranjo. Now the water had gone above the head, so Rainshaho, and took a team and caught the helicopter. He killed and destroyed the helicopter completely. After that he picks up the remaining pieces and flashes them, but the soldiers are not giving up. Finally he put a hair dryer in the toilet which killed all the soldiers. A soldier from outside slipped a note on which was written, hand yourself over to us, seeing their cunning. Rancho he was also surprised and he also wrote in response that fuck years. But when he went to put the paper back, he understood that it was a trick of theirs. The whole army of toys was ready to attack with tanks. Their vigorous attack blew the door to pieces and now Rancho was directly on their target. He went out of the window to save his life, but the poor man could not even jump from the 14th floor. The well in front was stepping behind the ditch. Suddenly a helicopter attacked him again. Toys were about to fall him to the children. He shot down the helicopter in one shot, finally reaching the balcony. He breathed a sigh of relief, but the soldiers sitting inside stood ready with guns pointed at the window. Then an idea came to his mind provoked the attention of the person and then as soon as he got the opportunity, he attacked them with fire extinguisher from the other side. There was a tremendous stampede and then his eyes fell on some other soldiers. They took him home from all sides in the jeep and started firing continuously. Now the battle was going to be even more dangerous. Rain Show created a tremendous fire with the help of spray and lighter and the soldiers were alive he burned it and started cutting those toys into. Small pieces like crazy with a knife after which he threw a heavy box on the soldiers fighting with the fire extinguisher, under which everyone's sauce was made. Finally, all the military toys were killed. To ensure his victory, Ranjo matched all the toys to live and their box numbers. Now there was not a single soldier left and in this way his life was saved. He took the toy but forgot one thing that it was written on the back of the box that bonus surprise after playing everyone's game. He had a little to rest late came to the pool, but suddenly someone cut his wrist in the water. He quickly came out of the water and saw that the blood was flowing too much, so he tried his best to apply. Stitches with needle thread. Now he decided to go out of the house. 846, so that he could not attack this thing again, he was completely unaware that his enemies had reached the elevator with him. Suddenly all the blows broke and all the buttons operating the lift were also broken. Now Rancho was captured in this elevator, he turned on a flashlight and saw that only one commando was present there, the upper part of the lift was missing. So the commando got out of the elevator from the same way. Rancho also started following him and he saw that the lift was stuck. Now he had no way to escape, one last hope and with him on the roof of the adjacent elevator. He jumped, removed the ceiling panel and reached inside the lift. He had somehow escaped from the commando, but his happiness did not last long because the commando had also reached there by hiding with him. The toy started to push a knife into Rancho's body continuously, but Rancho did not mind his this time. Rancho caught him toy commando in both of the lifts. Rancho smiled at his body but soon realized that there was a bomb in the body of the toy. The explosion of the same sail bomb caused a loud explosion and the range which. Life also came to an end. After that we saw a sticker on the toy box on which it was written that as a bonus surprise it had a commando and thermonuclear bomb attached to it. With this the toy avenged the death of its owner, so in childhood what toy did you have that you loved the most like me by this remote control of mine? I like to tell in the comments. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe to our channel for more interesting recaps.